Hello everyone, this is Energy Crisis, the Energy Drink Report. So today, we'll be reviewing Zombie Survival Can. Uh, well, first off, this is a unique drink, per se. Almost as unique as blood. Well, because if you think about it, Zombie Survival Can. How many drinks do you see that actually, first off, talk about zombies? I mean, not many. I mean, like you get Monster, you know, you get Amp. Red Bull, but nothing about zombies most of the time. I mean, there are some drinks like that. Now, it's a pretty small can. I mean, not even as big as uh, Bing. Relatively smaller, you know. Uh, let's see. You now, packaging, I mean, it's got, you know, in green, you know, written, uh, the word zombie written in green, I should say. So it'll probably stand out. So that's the first thing that may come to mind. Uh, you know, it's either like a black or a dark red, I should say, in some spots. Like right around here, it's a dark red. Uh, then you have this little thing, which is neat, which I will read to you. Get the nutritional stats. So, uh, you know, it's a pr pretty simple can, but kind of unique in some ways, because most cans don't say what to do in a zombie attack with this can, I should say. Alright, so, uh, let's see, 8.4 fluid ounces. Uh, I think serving size is just this one can. Alright, let's see. No grams of fat, 175 milligrams of sodium, 110 calories, 28 grams of sugar. Main ingredients, filtered carbonated water, high fructose corn syrup, citric acid, taurine, sodium citrate, natural flavors, caffeine, potassium sorbate, etc., etc. Caffeine content is not specified here. Uh, before, you know, we open this up, uh, let me read to you what this says. In case of zombie apocalypse, drink entire can contents to ensure speedy escape. It's this. Fill can with rocks, then fill can at zombie. And it's got a little target at the zombie's head. Substitute for gas mask in case of toxic cloud. Use can to collect rainwater, boil if necessary, dispose of can properly, sounds of water can alert zombies of your presence. <laughs> funny, it's just funny to see it's on like an energy drink, you know? And you'll probably be thinking, where the hell did I get this? And I think they only sell it online, but I'll discuss that to you later on. Alright, well, let's open this up. Do uh, you think I'll miss or no? I don't think so. But if I do, just come running with tissues. Uh, regardless, so. Alright, let's put this. Well, I did spill a tiny bit. You could just hand that to me here. I don't care if it goes in the camp. Oh, boy, you threw it at me. Oh, that's lovely. I just don't like, you know, to get the table messy, you know, during a review. I just think that's appalling. But hey, you know, accidents happen, mistakes happen, but oh well. You could just deal with it. Alright, so looking at this, this is kind of like that, um... I shouldn't say urine shade of yellow. No, it's a yellow kind of, right? Actually, it is yellow, but a clear type, you know, it's like, um... You know, really clear. Some drinks are actually cloudy. They had so much stuff in them. And they were cloudy and you couldn't see the bottom. But this one, I mean, first off, it's a cute little glass it's in. Second of all, I can see the camera and everything through the glass. Pretty carbonated by the looks of it, though. But it does have that watery type of appearance, you know? <sighs> smell. Smell, smell, smell. I don't know, for some reason I'm getting like a lemon type, but... A uh, lemon or orange type, a lemon or orange type of this, you know, uh, but, you know, because my nose isn't the best today, so if I'm wrong, I'll just, you know, I'll get the correct smell in, like, a caption, you know, in the video, but I'm, I apologize for this, but I'm saying a lemon. Yeah, lemon, lemon, that's what I'm saying. All right, so let's take a drink here. All right, cheers. You know, I have to say, 
It doesn't taste terrible. It's pretty carbonated. Carbonation hits the tongue. I mean, it really doesn't taste that lemony. It kind of tastes almost like... Almost like, um, carbonation. Almost like a fruit punch or like some sort of thing like that. I mean, when you try it, you know, you have to really see what it tastes like. Because it's kind of like a unique flavor. Kind of like a big mix. So it kind of tastes... But in my opinion, you could really taste that hint of lemon, you know, the most. And you get a bunch of other fruity flavors, but mostly the lemon. That's what really stands out to me. Lemon. Uh, and also, you know, the carbonation. But I mean, the thing is that it really, the carbonation doesn't even hit your throat because it's all, all gone almost by the time it gets into the back of your mouth. Which is kind of convenient because I don't know if you like the taste of the bubbles going down. Unless you have a sore throat, of course, that might be good. But otherwise, you know. Alright, so, uh, aftertaste, you do get this little lemon aftertaste, but that's pretty, you know, that's fine, you know. Uh, alright, effectiveness of this, I cannot do. Now, I think last time, I did Amp Sugar-Free Lightning, and let me just check for reference purposes. Yep, Amp Sugar-Free Lightning I did, and, uh, effectiveness of that... It was pretty decent, I mean, pretty decent. Now, uh, Amp is a pretty good, you know, beverage, in my opinion. Uh, so Amp kept me up for a good, I don't know, six hours. Because I know I took it at around eight, right after dinner. It kept me up until around two, three. Well, that's a pretty good effectiveness, you know, if you need to study for a test. Now that, you know, school started back up. Which, uh, my school year is pretty good. I mean, I gotta take the public bus home and stuff. So, uh, you know. I don't wanna drag this on too long of story time, because this is probably already going over ten minutes. <laughs> but I doubt it. Uh, well. Uh, alright. Anyway, taking the public bus home, it's just interesting, you know. Price wise, with, uh, uh, this, uh, zombie survival can, two dollars. I don't know, you know, if shipping and handling or anything. I don't know if that'll be two fifty or anything. Or is it just two dollars? Just two dollars. Okay. Uh, anyway, so uh, I don't think they sell this in stores at all. You know, I don't think. Yeah, I think you could only get this online uh, for around two dollars. So pretty decent. And I don't think you're forced to buy like a five pack of them either. I think you could just like get uh, get one of them. So that's that's pretty convenient. And, you know, for two dollars. I mean, that's good. That's good. You know. Alrighty. So. Uh, I guess that's about all. Current time is three fifty seven. My weather report last week was wrong. It was wrong. Absolutely wrong. Because uh, let me tell you, after I mean it rained. Did it rain? The people that were just recovering from Irene, you know, if the flooding got battered again with the remnants of Lee. Just glad that Katia and, uh, I don't know what Maria's gonna do. Those are all, like, hurricanes or tropical storms out if you don't keep up with the, uh, tropic, tropical weather. Anyway, boy, did we get more rain. And, uh, Texas, they're just in a heavy drought. And here up in New York, we're just getting, like, <laughs> feel like I'm Goliath over here. That's my fish. feel like we're swimming around in water getting so much rain. Regardless, all right, I guess that's about all. Enjoy your Saturday. Have a good day at school, work, enjoy the weekend. And, uh, that's about all. All right, everyone. Have a good day. This is Energy Crisis. Energy Drink Report. Bye-bye.